So it's like a cheap fan. Guy comes here, looks at it, says, no, it's too noisy. It's a fan. It's noise. It makes a fan that makes noise. Okay. Both wearing masks. Hear the noise? I don't hear no noise. They all make this sound. It's on high speed. Nothing wrong with the fan. It's a cheap fan. Maybe like a Chinese fan. What do you expect? Oh man. There's one of them with the mask on. This. Another one with the mask on. I upside down? I don't know, this fan rattles too. Oh my god, it rattles. I'm upside down. Oh well. It will rattle, it has uh, steel fan blades, or aluminum fan blades. For a second, if you move it, it'll go da -da 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 -da. All fans do that though. Anyway, as stated in Junkland, um, I'm pretty much done with trying to sell stuff to people that could be usable. Instead, I keep it myself, I run it till it's no good, I throw it away, I junk it, any usable material, or it just really gets junked. It really gets junked. Or, sometimes, like some parts, you can list them online. And people actually see value on things for five to ten dollars online, you know, and in bulk, it actually adds up. But this unbelievably, how dumb people are again in Southwest Florida or come to Southwest Florida. They're just dumb. They're they're literally mentally insane, and I'm kind of done dealing with it. Have reasonable expectations. It is used. It is a used item. You know it is a used item. It is a cheap item. It is a cheap item. It is used. What more do you expect? It's like a cheap used car. And someone will go, oh my god, it has an oil leak. Oh man, it, one tire is a little more worn than the other one. Oh my god, the seat has a rip in it. You know. Cheap used car. What do you expect? I don't know.